I'm Sarah Hashimaris for the Los Angeles Times. The former head of the IRS testified to senators in Washington today, expressing his dismay at a recent report on the agency as it deals with revelations that some of its officials inappropriately scrutinize conservative groups seeking tax-exempt status. Five-year IRS head Douglas Shulman, who retired in November 2012, appeared before the Senate Finance Committee alongside his successor, Stephen T. Miller, and Treasury Inspector General for the Tax Administration, Jay Russell George. The Times reports that Shulman and Miller denied knowledge of inappropriate activity at the agency and said the failure to recognize the scope of the actions by lower ranking managers is likely at fault. Shulman, in his opening remarks, spoke of the challenges the IRS faces and said the agency does its job in an admirable way the great majority of the time. Committee Chairman Max Baucus asked Shulman why the alleged political targeting was not handled more firmly, calling it outrageous, adding that any person can figure out this is unacceptable conduct. Stay with us for more on this story on LATimes.com and for more headlines, check out at LATimes on Twitter.